What's up guys? Welcome back to Life of Lane Butt. If you're a loyal subscriber and have watched a lot of my videos or you just watch me on a regular basis, you might have noticed that I did not post a video last week. Last year when I started college, I started out really strong and I posted a video every single week and then it kind of just fell apart, especially back then. I was taking 18 hours and it was just so overwhelming and I just had a lot of stuff to do. Okay, that sounds like such a bad excuse. But anyway, basically what happened is I fell off. I would just post videos randomly and there was no schedule and it's bad for the algorithm it's bad for keeping subscribers and it's just inconsistent and I need to be on some type of schedule right at least in my head anyways all that to say I think the plan for right now is to post every other week also I wanted to say thanks again so much there was so just the last video did so well and obviously that's all because of you guys I think we got like triple average views triple average watch hours longer watch time way more likes than normal also you probably can tell from the lighting that I still haven't found a place to film and I don't have a regular setup I think it might be cool and quirky to do all my intros and outros at least in the car so we might try that for a little bit but I definitely need to find a place with better lighting or just commit to doing it a golden hour every day what if I did it like over here it's just so bright anyways I am clearly at school and so far as far as I know don't have coronavirus and we haven't been sent home or like shut down that's really exciting when we did get sent home last year and we were in actual quarantine I made a video on what my online classes and school at home looked like you can go check it out right here if you want but since I'm at school I figured I would give you guys an in-person school day in my life so you guys can see what it's like going to the calf and hanging out with my friends and trying to do fun social stuff with people all that good stuff this is that video i hope you enjoy a day in my life of school corona college edition all right guys so not to be too sciencey but a great day starts with a great night's sleep but depending on when i need to get up and what classes i have i try and schedule it out so that i get like six to eight solid hours of sleep which often means taking melatonin i do that way too much probably then this morning when I got up, I just decided to clean up the little bit of mess that I had left behind the night before with some dirty dishes and I also like reorganized my snacks and all my food and stuff in the shelves to make it look a bit neater. I also filled up our Brita filter so that I could drink my obscene amount of water throughout the day. Um, this is our dorm's kitchenette, it's just like a sink and we also have the toaster and the microwave and the Keurig, but it's really nice to have like the extra space. Next up was skincare, hair, makeup, and like brushing my teeth. I've kind of got a good routine going with all of this stuff, um, and I've really been enjoying it because I feel like I don't usually have a routine. The skincare routine is a lot different than the expensive one that I showed you guys last winter, but with the dorm water and the stress from like my personal life, plus wearing a mask all day and just my skin being gross due to that, I'm using drugstore cleanser twice a day as well as toner that I stole from my mom rose water, I don't know if that does anything, and drugstore moisturizer. Honestly, I love the moisturizer. I also thought that makeup would be a thing that I slacked on a lot this semester, but I've actually done it most mornings, and I have something, a routine going that I kind of like, so maybe I'll do a little 10-minute makeup routine about that at some point. I also changed out of my pajamas and made myself some peanut butter toast, which is pretty nice, and gave me some carbs and fats and protein to start my day. I've been calorie tracking again recently, trying to get that hot girl fall bod, so breakfast is pretty important now to like try and meet my calorie goals every day all right guys so on fridays i have three classes one at nine one at ten and one at eleven and like i've told you before i go to a really small school so all of those classes are actually in one building and that building is maybe 30 feet from my dorm um so in the mornings i literally spend more time climbing the stairs of my dorm and the building that i go to class in um instead of like walking across campus but it's pretty nice. Um, here's one of my classrooms if you were wondering what those look like. Here is me on the Zoom camera in one of my rooms. There I am. I then went to lunch and hung out with my friends Sarah, Audrey, and Haley. Haley got me this awesome coin sticker for my water bottle. So, you know, like stream, dreamland or whatever. So I haven't really been able to, like obviously the lighting here is not ideal and I have not been able to find a spot on campus that's like quiet and not busy obviously. I wanted to tell you guys about my classes. Today is a Friday. The way that my classes are set up, I have, I basically have the same classes Monday, Wednesday, Friday, except I have one class that's only on Mondays from like 5 to 8, 
which is kind of annoying. And then I just have one class on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Today I just had three classes and I wanted to tell you guys about them because this is a day in my life at school, so I figure you gotta be somewhat interested in what I'm taking, right? First off, I have human sexuality and that's probably probably my favorite class, not gonna lie to you guys. This week we've been talking about like female uh sexual anatomy and physiology not gonna lie i don't know the difference between anatomy and physiology but very like validating and like cool to learn about yourself and stuff because obviously i have all of that also wanted to say this week so right now how we have it i'm in pretty small classes so all of my classes except for one like cohorts and i'm in cohort one for all my classes so this week i have one class that's always like you can either do zoom or in person and that's my Monday night class. But otherwise, this week, all my classes, I go in person. And then next week, I'm all on Zoom. And all of mine are broken up into two cohorts. So I just go every other week. Then I had a class called Great Ideas in Politics, which it's confusing because I have that class. And then I have Great Ideas in Philosophy. And so far in Great Ideas in Politics, we've only talked about political philosophy. Also, my night class um, is basically about politics. So it's really confusing trying to like keep the textbooks and the information and stuff separate. But anyway, I had great ideas in politics and I have to study for that like every day for the next week. He moved the test to next Friday instead of next Wednesday, so that's really exciting. For me, you probably don't care, but that's what I'm gonna be doing all weekend. Oh yeah, and then I had great ideas in philosophy where we talked about ontological arguments and I have realized I haven't done any of the reading for that class, so I probably need to get on that. Um, and then I just went and had lunch with my friends Sarah and Audrey and uh, Haley was there too, my roommate. And we ended up talking for a really long time and having some like deep conversations and it was just a really good time. Anyway, that's where I'm at now. I've been having this weird thing where every time I have caffeine, my body shuts down a little bit and I want to take a nap. And I had coke at lunch because I'm trying to <laughs> reach my calorie goal for the day today. I'm going to take a nap and then I really need to study but I also haven't worked out all week so I might. I'm gonna go take a nap. <laughs> I'll keep you guys updated. Okay, bye-bye. Okay guys, so I just finished my nap. Nap. Me watching Community and me accidentally falling asleep. Like I told you guys, the lighting in here is not good. Anyways, now that I have napped too long, I think what I'm going to do is get some snacks. I have to actually study. So let's just let's just write down what I should do. First, I'm going to try and airdrop everything into iMovie that I filmed today because it's really filling up my phone storage today for some reason. I'm supposed to be studying for an exam next Friday. Look how neat my notes are looking though. That's pretty aesthetic. I think my handwriting is really good. Some people say it's terrible, but I think it's amazing. And then I need to read the rest of my human sexuality chapter. And that's gonna take forever. This is literally the longest chapter ever. Like I said, it's female anatomy and it is... There's, there's a lot down there, let me tell you. Okay, then I think I'll start making my politics terms quizlet. I'm making like three quizlets for this test and that is a lot. And I have a video to watch for how to disagree better. And I should probably read for that as well. Actually, I think then I'm going to edit some stuff down because it's going to take up a lot of space on my computer. Also, I apologize if you can hear my air conditioning. It just gets really loud every like 10 minutes, so. And then I think I'll read like half of my philosophy stuff. And I think that feels good for tonight. I might study some more, but um, anyway, I think I'm going to get carrots and popcorn. And I'm going to put my time lapse on so you guys can watch me studying so that I'm not on my phone. Which Wish me luck with that here we go wow guys so this is me studying as you can tell i'm a star student and very organized um spoiler alert i did not finish all of my homework or go to the gym on this day um but i did help my roommate Haley sew her pants kind of she thrifted these long corduroys and then made them into shorts they turned out super cute and here's my fit for dinner wow looking good Hey guys, now me and Haley are walking to dinner. Um, didn't plan anything to say <laughs> besides that, but yeah, yeah, good. we're meeting our Rosemary friends Rachel chicken. and Ashton. Yeah, rosemary chicken, thatounds yeah. pretty good. See you up there. Yeah. There they are. Dinner, dinner. Yeah, it's on Instagram. <laughs> hey. Um, okay, so we went to dinner and you know, it was all right. It wasn't the best dinner I've ever had. I came in here and I did a tiny bit of homework and I edited 
this video down a lot, which probably wasn't the most productive thing to do, but I made a lot of progress, so pretty, I guess I'm like proud of that. Anyways, now we're going to the pedestrian bridge, which I've never been to, but everyone talks about it all the time and said it's really cool. Um, and we're also just gonna like drive around and listen to music and whatever, because everything's closed and we're not trying to get sick, so. <laughs> Fit check. Oh, I might wear this again tomorrow, I'm not gonna lie. So anyway, we're gonna do that. That's probably the last thing I'll do. And then we went to the pedestrian bridge and listened to Fall Out Boy. Pedestrian bridge, 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 pedestrian bridge. We just got back from the pedestrian bridge and now I'm going to take a shower and get ready for bed. Okay, so if you guys were wondering what happened after my shower, basically I just did my skincare routine, got my makeup, brushed my teeth, got in my PJs, and then I fell asleep watching Community. That is what a day in my life at school looks like. I'm very thankful that my school still hasn't been shut down and that I'm not doing online school again. At least half the time I'm not doing online school, still get to see my friends and everything. Obviously this isn't the most exciting day in my life that I could give you ever, but it's what life looks like now and I wanted to remember it when things change and and hopefully when things go back to normal, I won't take it for granted. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. As always, please feel free to like this video and subscribe if you haven't. I will see you guys in two weeks. Bye-bye.